One of the most amazing things about Macavacus is its ability to link reliably between the Office applications. Let's take a look at how this works. Over on the left-hand side, we're working in Excel. And as you can see, we've already gone ahead and inserted a nice football field chart here. Let's select the chart, then go up to the Macavacus section of the ribbon. And then under Export, we have a number of options. We could export and match the width, the height, the size, or we could say Export None. And you can see below, the shortcut for this is Control-Alt-Right. Let's go ahead and hit Control-Alt-Right arrow. And as you can see, what happens is this gets exported right over into the PowerPoint environment. Now let's go ahead and make some changes in Excel. We could go change the bonus line value here, which is set to seven. We could change it to say five. And maybe we wanna change the fill color here over to a little bit of an orange color. Now let's go over to PowerPoint and investigate how to get these changes to come through. Let's head over to PowerPoint and maximize the PowerPoint screen. If we want the changes now to come reliably through the link, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go up here under links and click refresh and say refresh all shape and text links. What we get is a positive confirmation that that's been completed. And as you can see, the new price of $5 comes through and the change in fill color came through from blue over to orange. One thing which Macabacus users really appreciate is how reliable these links are once they've been established. The other thing which is great about Macabacus is it has lots of ability for us to manage these links. Let's take a look at how that works. Here in the PowerPoint environment, we can go under the Macabacus section of the ribbon up to Explorer pane. Let's just click that and we get an Explorer pane. As you can see, we can see slide number one here. If we open that up, we can see that right in here, we get a little link icon showing us that we have a link to this chart. So we can go ahead now and just close down this Explorer pane. One of the other ways that can be really helpful for us to manage links is if we go up to the Macabacus section of the ribbon, under links, we have this icon here, which says manage links. If we open that up, we can see a list of all the links we've established between Excel and PowerPoint. Let's go ahead and close down this manage links dialog box now. We're about to show you now one of our absolute favorite ways of seeing where the links are visually within a presentation. First, let's go over and investigate what's happening in the view menu. As you can see, we are in a normal view presently. Let's go up to the Macabacus section of the ribbon and under links, let's select this, highlight links. As you can see, what Macabacus has done now is it's put us over, if we check the view section of the menu, we're now in a slide sorter view. But what's really important, we're able to see where the links are with these yellow highlights within our presentation, which is so helpful. Let's go ahead and get back into a normal view now, just by double clicking on this slide. As we mentioned, this ability for Macabacus to link reliably between the Office applications is one of the most sought after features within Macabacus. Also, what's amazing about it is it's so easy for us to keep track of and manage our links. We can go up here, we can use Explorer pane, we can go into this particular little button here to manage our links, or we can go as far as actually physically highlighting the links that we've made in PowerPoint. Although we've demonstrated these from Excel over to PowerPoint, they work in a very similar fashion from Excel over to Word. If you're enjoying these tips and would like to see more of our content, please like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for your support and we'll see you soon in the next video.